What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another reaction video. Today we're checking out how much do F1 teams get paid by WTF1. Been reacting to a couple of his videos on this channel so far. Love it. Love making Formula 1 videos. I know you guys do too. So let's get into it. So this is like, what, the second video I made? <laughs> Just about money with F1. Hey, money money's a big part. Around. And as you've probably guessed, the world Formula go 1 round. teams cannot run without it. So how much money do F1 teams get paid over the course of a season? How massively does it vary between My guess teams? in US dollars would be three to, the three to five, the average. Almost 10 times Let's see. The amount of the lowest three to five million. Completely wrong. So, how do I explain I guess. this simply? Unfortunately, it's not as easy as first in the championship gets paid the most, Probably then second, then big part of advertisers too. You have many factors to take into account when adding up all the dollar dollar bills flying about. F1 teams firstly get paid $36 million if the team has been classified over two of the past three years, which everyone apart from Haas had done last year. It's important to note that all these fascinating facts and figures are from the 2017 season. I guess Roman Grosjean had a little more to complain about than just his breaks after hearing the news that after the first checkpoint, Haas are behind I think I'm going to be reacting to his crash soon, too, in the next couple of weeks. Million dollars. Heard it was pretty bad. $36 million equates to 240 front wings, just so you're aware. That's some the big dollars. Breaks to work. The second stream of money if you're comes tired today and will have a great life for the rest of your life. From the previous season. So if we look to 2016, Mercedes were paid a whopping $61 million. That's like... 122 million packets of Skittles. I need that. How many move for Skittles now? 6.8 billion Skittles. Whereas Jeez. Ferrari, who came third in the constructors, were paid practically pennies with 41 million dollars. Practical pennies, yeah, right. We can now start to understand why Force India implemented team orders to make sure they finished as high as they possibly could in the season of 2017. After two streams of money and what I'm going to call round one, we have Mercedes in the lead, nine million. So basically, just the, the bigger, the more popular the Red Bull their car brand is. Ferrari surprisingly only five million dollars ahead of Force India, with Williams or just the team name, of course. Far behind. But is it over? I hear you ask. No, no, it's not because I literally just said it's the end of round one. Duh. Now moving on to the second and final round, but this. But I'm curious though, how does it divide up? Streams. Hopefully, it touches the on that. Of these is LST. Is there a coach? Is there means? obviously is there a pairman? The driver. I like to call the Ferrari budget. In 2017, Ferrari were the only team to receive this bonus of 68 million dollars. That's a big Absolutely bonus. Crazy. I think everyone can say at this stage, Ferrari is well and truly in the lead of the budget race. We now come on to nice the CCB, stuff, nice which stands for the Constructors' Championship Bonus. This is where Ferrari, Not another Mercedes, bonus. Red Bull, and McLaren all receive bonus payments amounting to a total of $143 million, with Mercedes and Red Bull receiving Jeez. the most with $39 million each. So we've spoken a lot about bonuses, and I've said the word a lot. I'm starting to wonder if bonus is even a word. Well, we've now it come has to, to the be. final segment, which are other bonuses. This is where Williams collect a cheeky $10 million heritage payment and run straight Just to the Just off a bonus? Red Bull nab another $35 million for All right. the first well, to sign the Concord Agreement. Now I know that there's a lot of money involved in the sport. Bernie Ecclestone and, well, Mercedes also turn up with their wheelbarrow to collect another special annual payment of $35 million for hitting their oh target in the World Championships. A lot of numbers, a lot of money, but Correct. this is how it all looks after whoever is editing this has used their calculator to add it all up. Is it right to have a team who finished third in the Constructors' Championship in 2016 being paid the most in 2017? Poor old Hass I mean, bottom bringing in a depressing... I'm not going to comment on that. That's you guys. Surely you guys let me know. new F1 teams don't, or, or more importantly, can't stay in F1. At least this year, Hass will get a share of that first lovely pool of money. Well, that was a quick video, but I do have some questions. All right. So let's just say, for example, uh, Mercedes, Team Mercedes, okay, gets paid $40 million. Now, is that $40 million after a race? Is that after a year? Okay. And then who's on Team Mercedes? Is it just one person or is there other bunch of racers? Let's say there are five racers uh, or five drivers who are part of Team Mercedes and that $40 million is all split up to them. And then, of course, does it divide into, you know, their pairs, the coach, if there is a coach, I don't know what they call it in uh, Formula One, uh, stuff like that. So I don't know, how does that like divide up and all? If you guys could describe it to me in the comments, that'd be really appreciate it. But I just wanna know where does this money come from, okay? When does it distribute? So does it distribute after every race or after every year? And then who does it go to? Who's it paying, okay? Your pairs, is it paying the driver? It's paying the, the coach, if there is a coach. 
But uh, yeah, guys, if you guys could let me know on that, that'd be really appreciated because obviously, like I, uh, if you haven't, you know, seen already, I am a new F1 uh, fan. I'm getting into it. It's really interesting. Really interesting. A lot of money involved, uh, as you can see. But yeah, guys, hopefully you enjoyed. If you guys did, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe to my channel. Recommend more videos that can help me out and entertain you guys. I'm out. Peace.